Hi guys and uh, welcome back. Uh, we were left uh, with the uh, bumper modeling and uh, today we are going uh, to see uh, how modeling uh, the hood. Uh, but uh, before to do that, we uh, always take a look uh, to our shape to improve it. We have to give more smooth in this part. Here we have to place better these points in the top view. We have uh, a vertex uh, that we don't need and we have to delete it and now we can create a new age loop in this area So we can go in object mode and we can go in the multicut and we can create a new age loop here. And we have to place uh, better this point. And also, we have to add more detail in this part. We can select all these edges and we can go in the scale tool. We have to place this point here and now we can select all these edges and uh, we can choose poly extrude. and press R on the keyboard to scale it and also we can move down it a little bit and now We have to place better this point and also we have to align this point uh, on the grid with the X on the keyboard. And now we can select all these edges uh, 
and uh, we can choose poly extrude and W on the keyboard we can uh, take it uh, here and press R on the keyboard to scale them and uh, in the side view we can take uh, it uh, up a little bit We have to extrude this edge also. And we have to align uh, that on the side view. And uh, we have to snap and merge the vertex now we have to grab all these edges and uh, we can choose poly extrude and w and let's go to place uh, these points over the guard line right and now uh, we have to we have to grab all these uh, points and we have to move them up in uh, the side view this way and now we we have to create uh, another edge loop in this part so We can choose uh, insert edge uh, loop tool and now we have to place these points in top view. Uh, and now we have uh, to add uh, the tail uh, to our shape in this position with the insert edge loop
and uh, also we have to create uh, uh, a new geometry in this part we can uh, use uh, in this case uh, uh, append to polygon tool We can press G on the keyboard for the last command and uh, let's go to fill the hole. Alright. And now we have to move this point uh, along the curve with the C on the keyboard to keep a, a, a good topology alright and now we have to select uh, all these edges and we can uh, choose a poly extrude inside view and let's go to place the points along the curve in this way And now we have to place the point uh, in top view also. way All right and now we can uh, grab all the sages and we can use uh, poly extrude and W on the keyboard and R to scale them in the top view Right, and now we have to snap and merge this vertex.
and now we can select uh, all these edges again and we can use fully extrude we have to snap uh, the vertex on the grid and merge them all right that's all for now in the next lesson we are going to add the tail to our shape and also we are going to see how modeling the hole for the radiator support. Thank you for uh, the watch. See you in the next lesson.